editing your work, I'm assuming mm-hmm. every change is like fully competent with full knowledge. You know, I just give you way more respect mm-hmm. than I give myself. So it's harder yes. to find those flaws mm-hmm. because I'm like, surely Gerhard knew what he was doing when he said this. So I must not know what I'm doing because it looks wrong. And so it takes me yeah. longer to actually be like, no, actually he just made a mistake. I really appreciate that, by the way, the respect <laughs> part. Yeah. Thank you very much, Jared. <laughs> that means a lot. <laughs> but I do make mm-hmm. mistakes actually a lot. So a lot of the time I fix them so quickly that people don't even know I've made them. But trust me. That's the key right yeah, there. Mistakes, I, like, there's so many I make, right? All the time, every single yeah. day. Hundreds and hundreds of them because it's essential to learning. Anyway, experimenting, right? That's At least that's how I see it. So when you were describing your DN simple findings earlier in the conversation, and now we have yes. you guilty again, it reminds me of this amazing quote by Felipe Fortes. I'm not sure if he originated this or if he just has the tweet, but he says, debugging is like being the detective in a crime movie where you are also the murderer. <laughs> That's exactly what it feels like, yes. I murder the infrastructure. <laughs> it's my fault and I have to fix it because <laughs> I messed it up. <laughs> yeah, why Kubernetes? Why? <laughs> 